our next topic is user defined functions first of all how to create function m files the user defined functions are stored as m files and can be accessed by matlab if they are in the current folder or on matlab's search path each must start with the function definition line that contains the word function a variable that defines the function output a function name a variable used for the input argument let us take an example that calculates the value of particular polynomial we're going to write the function uh, not here i'm going to write the function in the editor window function output equals to poly x let me just check the spelling output equals to poly x no i'm just adding the comments with each line this function calculates the value of third order polynomial now the output equals to 3 into x raised to power 3 plus 5 into x raised to power Two plus no minus two into x plus one. Uh, I have to end the function. Uh, I'm going to save the function. with the name poly so the function name is poly the input argument is x and the out output variable is named output now save this now in command window here i'm going to write poly 4 so this corresponds to 265 if we set a variable like a equal to 4 and use a as the input argument we get the same result like a equals to 4 poly a this gives the same result if we define a vector we get a vector of answers like y equals to 1 to 5 then poly y this gives the vector of answers if however you try to execute the function by selecting the save and run icon from the function menu bar the following error message will displayed like if you want to run the program the message will be displayed as this the value of x must be passed to the function when it is used either in command window or from within a script m file program so next is functions with multiple inputs and outputs now just as the predefined matlab functions may require multiple inputs and may return multiple outputs more complicated user defined functions can be written a user defined function could be written to multiply two vectors together in the editor window like function output equals to g x comma y so i am going to add the comment here this function multi multiplies x and 
y moreover x and y must be same size matrices so now a equals to x into y and output equals to a you know and the function i'm going to save this function with name g now in the command window when x and y are defined and the function g is called a vector of output values is returned like x equals to 1 to 5 and y equals to 5 to 9 then g of x comma y gives the answer as this so next is functions with no input or no output now all the most functions need at least one input and return at least one output in some situations no inputs or outputs are required let us consider a function which draws a star in polar coordinates we will write this function in the data window function star where theta equals to pi by 2 zero point eight um, pi by 2 zero point eight into pi we'll take the value as zero point eight into pi to 4.8 into 5 so this is theta r equals to 1 1,6 and polar theta comma r so here the square brackets on the first line indicate that the output of the function is an empty matrix that is no value is returned the empty parenthesis tell us that no input is expected now this is my function i am going to save this function i am going to run by typing star in the command window here even no values are returned but figure window opens showing a star drawn in polar coordinates next is accessing m file code now the functions provided with matlab are of two types one type is built in and the code is not accessible for us to review the other type consists of m files stored in toolboxes provided with the program Now you can see these m files with the type command like uh, there is a sphere function that creates a three dimensional representation of the sphere this i just simply write type sphere this will return the contents of sphere dot m file or i can also use a command as type in parentheses within single quotation mark sphere this will also return the same result so this is all 